So in this chip-in session, we're going to consider what is the correct chip and what is an incorrect uh, chip. Now, getting the correct chip shot is vitally important. Many club golfers have an idea that the flight of the golf ball when chipping should be like that rainbow type ball flight where the ball loops up nicely in the air and then lands softly on, on the ground. Now although you can chip in this way, it's not necessarily the most effective way um, to chip. So when I talk about the rainbow flight, let me just demonstrate what I mean by that. Most people have this idea of chipping the ball up in the air with this looping rainbow effect. But the problem that you have with that is when the ball lands, you don't know whether it's going to land and stop or land and bounce on. So it's not going to give you um, enough feedback as to what the ball is going to do. But a simpler way of chipping is to get the ball on the green as quick as possible and rolling up to the flag. This way you're treating it more like a putt, so you've got better control over distance. So let me just demonstrate again by throwing this ball. So I need to get the ball lower, rolling on the green as quick as possible. That's a much simpler way of chipping a ball. To get the ball on the green, rolling as quick as possible, that way you can gauge distance control. So what I'm going to do now is just get a golf club and show you the basic method of how we're actually going to chip. 